At the start of February, Sean spoke about Richard Branson and co heading down the Great Blue Hole and finding a, a load of plastic, unfortunately. Uh, it was rather a sad story uh, that really sort of woke a lot of people up when it comes to looking at plastic pollution. Uh, to watch this video, just click on the link that's just popped up. I think it's over here. Uh, okay, so fast forward to, well, now. Uh, the same team who are now on dry land have gone through all of their data and have found something rather interesting. And no, it wasn't more plastic. Well, yeah, there probably was more plastic, but that's not the exciting bit. Whilst going down to the whole seabed, they carried out a 360 degree sonar scan of the hole to which as of recording is nearly completely rendered. So not only is the scan a first, but the team are now releasing other things they discovered in the hole. Other than plastic, the team found never before seen stalactites, which is pretty cool. Uh, they also found a set of tracks on the seabed uh, as well as uh, of yet, they haven't been able to identify what caused those tracks, so that's quite intriguing. Cracker! Uh, it's a cracker! A really tiny crack. Um, so yeah, the journey started off rather depressing, thanks to plastic pollution, uh, but now the information is sort of coming through and it's being released about the trip. Things are actually looking on the up, which is just great news. Uh, we all can't wait to see the 3D sonar scan when it's finally ready and what else this team will be releasing over the next couple of months. So are you happy that the team is now releasing news about the blue hole? That isn't just doom and gloom like plastic pollution. Uh, what do you think made the tracks on the seabed? The you, Kraken, I told you. Do you think it was the Kraken? Um, it Sean thinks it is. Uh, anyway, let's have a chat about it in the comments. Thanks for watching and safe diving. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.